collected by Zabrowski there. In over the blue line with Zahara Chuck. Right side turning, shooting, took the safe rebound, but just wide. Zahara Chuck. When the Kootenai Ice traded a fifth round draft pick for Jesse Zahara Chuck November 29th, it will mark the second year forward's first move in the WHL and a chance to make a difference on a struggling team. For me, there's a lot of opportunity here. They said I was going to be playing top minutes, especially when I first came. They were they didn't have a whole lot of bodies too. They had a lot of injuries. It was an opportunity for Jesse to come in and play in a role that uh, you know he certainly wanted to be in and, and be in a top six role. And you know he's a skilled player, and you know, we've got some depth. Uh, you know, in, the, in in our size and physicality and, and work ethic, we just needed to add in some more, you know, natural hockey talent, and uh, Jesse brings that. So the Sherwood Park native would find himself skating on the top line shortly after his arrival in Cranbrook. When I first came, Zach was hurt, so uh, me and uh, Alfaro played together, and we started to get some chemistry. And then uh, when Zach came back too, I think we've all uh, been able to click for the most part. I think we're uh, starting to heat up a bit. Head coach Luke Pierce says Zahara Chuck has embraced his new role and is eager to improve. He's a smart hockey kid, so you know it's easy to have discussions with him about system stuff or about um, you know different looks that he can create, and he goes out and tries to implement them. And now Zahara Chuck scampers back the other way, right wing into Alfaro, left side Zabrowski back into the slot. Zahara Chuck bounces one just wide of the right post. Jesse is a very offensively gifted player, and he he just helps with us because we also are offensive and. To have a guy like that that can move pucks around, he's a really good passer and so it helps. He's great off the rush and he can hit me in the middle. Uh, I trust him with the puck on the wall and down low he's good and I think we've proven that, that we're a good line together. And the Yanks will come away to center once again. Zach Zabrowski turns around Hagel in over the Red Deer line, entry pass off Farrell and the goal line in front to Herichuk. Despite the chemistry he's created with his new line mates, the former Blazers still had to wait 13 games for his first victory in an ice uniform. A 3-1 win in Swift Current, January 3rd. Didn't know what winning was like for a bit, so uh, when that when that came around, it was definitely a special feeling for me and for the guys. Zahara Chuck with Alfaro on left wing is chopped back in deep again. Jesse Zahara Chuck there for it. He's spinning away from Colton Bobbick. Puck loose in the corner, comes free to the left point for Dallas Hines. At 5 foot 8 and 155 pounds, Zahara Chuck is currently the smallest player on the team, though he says players like Calgary Flames forward Johnny Goudreau Prove that size isn't everything. He's a pretty nifty player. He's kind of my, got my size too, so it's, it's always cool watching him. Off the ice, Zahara Chuck admits that life in Cranbrook has required quite the adjustment. It's definitely a smaller town, kind of smaller community. Everybody's closer. It kind of makes you hang out with the other guys on the team, so we become closer that way. For Go in Cranbrook, I'm James Fun.